In this session, we're going to talk about customizable settings, specifically color tables or, or pen tables. Earlier, we did some plotting. I'm going to come up and launch the plot command again. Here in the upper right corner is where we selected our plot style table. Currently, this is set to ACAD CTB. You may be wondering how you could create your own. I'm going to come over and click the edit button to edit this one, and we'll take a look. Now, when you're editing a pen table, there's two ways to view the data. You can use the table view, which is a lot like Microsoft Excel or we can go to the form view. This is the method I prefer. Over here on the left, we can see a listing of all of the colors in the AutoCAD color index. There are 255 color choices available. Let me take this back up to the top. Each one of these colors represents a pen. If you select a pen, you can come over here to the right and configure its settings. Currently, the color one is going to plot using the object color, although I could select any other color of my choice. I could also adjust the dithering, I could turn on grayscale, I could adjust the screening, I could select a line type or a line weight for this pen. So using this method we've got 255 unique pen choices that we can configure to plot to our needs. Now what if you'd like more options? Well we've got another method that we can use. Let me close this up. If I right click go to options. This brings up my program options. These are a lot like user preferences. I'm going to go to the plot and publish tab. From here I'll select plot style table settings. Right here you can see that we are using classic AutoCAD uh, plotting. We're using the color dependent plot styles. I can also use named plot styles. Now that I've made that selection I'm going to come down and choose add or edit plot style tables. And if we look in the list here you can see there's two types CTB and STB. CTB is a color table. STB is considered a named table. Now we edited the color table earlier. Let's, let's edit the named table. When I bring that up same workflow we can view the table in two different forms. I'm going to grab the form view. Now at first glance it doesn't look like there's much here. There's really just two pens. The beauty of the name system is you can have an infinite number of pens. You are not limited to the 255 colors in the AutoCAD color index. So using this system you could have 500, 700, 900, 1000 different pens if you want to. It's completely unlimited. Using these two options you can match or expand upon virtually any set of CAD standards.